Tecumseh win for a softball state 1A title today as the defending state champ. This is the third consecutive appearance for the Tecumseh girls in the state title game. But the team fell to Rossville 2-1. to one. Eyewitness News' Colin Davies is in West Lafayette with more from today's game. Tecumseh came to Purdue today looking for a three-peat as state champs, but they came up just short in a 2-1 loss to Rossville as the Hornets won their first state championship in school history. Let's show you the highlights. Packed house at Binninger Stadium and Rossville's Avery Layton showed up to the stage, striking out the first three batters. Bottom of the first runner on third for the Hornets when Caitlin Marks makes the catch in center and gets it to Donahue, who tags the runner out. Top of the fourth, Braves with Taylor Ash on third. Donahue grounds it out, but Ash opens the scoring. Not done yet. Runner on third. And it's going to be a diving catch made in right field by Raina St. Meyer to stop another run. Later, Paige Johnson matches a spectacular defense in right field. But in the bottom of the six, Rossville with two out magic. Allie Elliott goes to center, and this game is tied. Then right afterwards, Autumn Pascal all the way back to the wall, and Elliott bolts home and has the game winning run. Tecumseh falls two to one with just two hits for the Lady Braves. Avery Layton was just too good to stop today. Hats off to her, honestly. I mean, she was good. She was legit. After my first at bat, I was like, she's probably the best one we've seen. But this group's achieved a lot, winning two states in softball, one in basketball, and going to state in volleyball. The seniors recognize that while today didn't turn out the way they wanted, they'll leave the history books with multiple chapters of success at Tecumseh. It's been nothing but good experiences playing for him. And three years coming back here has been amazing and an experience no one can ask for. You look in the stands and you see all of them. All them little kids. They want to be a Jenna Donahue. They want to be a Taylor Rice. They want to be a Natalie Feather. They do. And, that, and that's the kind of legacy these seniors and juniors are doing. Next year's Tecumseh squad will be in 2A for softball. Reporting from Biddinger Stadium, I'm Colin Davies, Eyewitness News.